Hi, I'm Radu Popescu. Today we're going to talk about MSI Exec command lines. The Windows installer technology uses MSI Exec for installing MSI and MSP packages. This tool gives you full control over the installation process, allowing you to set install, display, restart, logging, update and repair options alongside setting public properties, which are used by the installation. On my screen, you can see an example of an usual form of MSI exec command line. Let's go to each command by typing MSI exec slash question mark. Install options accept the following switches. The most common are the slash I for the normal installation and the slash X for the uninstallation of the product. Here's an example of an MSI exec install command. MSI exec slash I followed by the path of our MSI. Moving on to display options. The user interface level of the installation can be configured according to the target environment. For example, a package distributed to clients should have a full UI, while a package deployed through a GPO or a configuration management tool should have no user interface. For example, using slash quiet, there is no user interaction, while using slash passive, the installation shows only a progress bar. You can also use slash Q in combination with other letters. Moving on, restart options. Sometimes an installation overrides files which are in use or needs to reboot the machine in order to finish it. The reboot policy used by this installation can be set to these options. In enterprise environment, the best practice is to not allow restart after a software installation. You don't want the machine to be auto-rebooted while the user is working on some important task. Here is an example of a command line. Next, logging options. For debugging an installation package, you can use multiple logging parameters in order to create a log. This log will contain different information for each parameter you use. The most common and useful option is to use the LV parameter. Also, you can add the name or the specific location of the log file. Update options. The Windows installer command line can apply or remove updates, patches for example, through the following options. Here's an example of a patch installation. Slash P, then the path to the patch. If you have an installed package, you can use the Windows installer command line for repairing it. Slash F followed by any of the following, then the product code of the application you want to repair. Last but not least, you can set values to your installer properties directly from the command line. For example, MSI exec slash I, path to your MSI, and the license key with the value. For more guides and tutorials, check out the Advanced Installer YouTube channel and also the Advanced Installer blog.